philanthropist Wes Plankard has been helping the kids from Attawapiskat for about three years now. Today, some of those kids are taking a school trip to Niagara Falls. Wes and the kids are meeting up today at Planet Hollywood. Let's go inside and check out some of the festivities. Well, basically, today is when the grade eights uh, from Attawapiskat come down to Niagara Falls. I believe they also go to Toronto um, for the end of the year grade eight trip. Uh, and the kids look forward to this all year, um, raising money uh, throughout the year, uh, basically nickeling and diming uh, their community. Um, and um, one story uh, that actually is basically about this trip is this one boy. Um, he was, you know, doing a bunch of bad stuff, graffiti and all that stuff. And they said, if you continue that, you're not going to be able to go on the trip. And uh, so he basically just totally changed his behavior, started getting really good grades, basically became a better person just to go on this trip. Uh, my goal is to build a playground in every single northern community with that one. Um, right now I'm trying to build two foster homes in Attawapiskat. Uh, I have teamed up with Peo Catano, which is um, a organization building foster homes. Um, and we've been working together for a pretty long time now, uh, trying to get two foster homes in Attawapiskat. That's going to take half a million dollars. Uh, and so right now I'm doing a penny campaign. Well, I've been helping uh, Attawapiskat for, um, I think it's three years now. Uh, and I just uh, really, you know, they're like family. And I really want them to know that there are people out there that care. It's a really great bunch of kids. And uh, I think that um, their time here in Niagara should be amazing because it's probably the only time that they're going to see Niagara since uh, the issues up there in the north and how far they are. This is uh, an annual trip that the grade eights take uh, each year at the end of uh, May, early June. And we spend one day down here in Niagara. Uh, go behind the falls, we do the Lady of the Mist, and it was amazing this morning. Um, in fact, I've never seen the falls so full and rich, so uh, it was a real treat uh, going out there. The input Wes had in, in our, in our uh, community there at Wapiscat with the, uh, the playground that he had put in, and he, and he put the playground right in the school where the portables are, like right in that area where the portables are. This past school year was the first year we had that playground available for the, predominantly the primary kids, but the junior kids and the intermediate kids, like when they get a chance, they're on the swings and they, they hang out around the equipment. It, it's sort of a, 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 a drop-in center, if you will. And, but the kids, like I watched the little kids on, on that, and it's just, it's phenomenal. They just love that. They interact so well in that area. They, it's something they've never had in the schoolyard. That is just a, a wonderful gift, uh, Wes, his contribution there to the children in Attawapiskat and, and, and also to the teachers. I mean, it gives the teachers a break on, at recess time when the kids are so engaged in their play and you know, the uh, teachers can kind of relax and there's, uh, there's less uh, conflict on the playground when the kids are so uh, wrapped up in play and fun are up and people are moved into them so so those I think there was 22 new houses brought in on the winter road and that's really helped uh, the situation there's still need of course there's still a housing uh, need there um, it's uh, it, it's ongoing you know, and I know he's not looking for any kind of accolades but I'm going to give just a little bit to bear some because out of all the communities that need help and there's a lot Wes has decided Attawapiskat is going to be the one that he's going to zero in on. And the fact that he has drawn attention to you and to some of the challenges, and he's not just drawing attention, he's come up with a solution.